What's going on everyone? It's Marcellus back with another video. We got to go over Baby Dogecoin today because we have so much going on for Baby Doge fundamentally. But as you can see, technically in the technicals, we don't have as much stuff going on, even in the crypto market in general, because of all of this FUD, fear, uncertainty, and doubt. But we're going to go over this and don't, don't get fooled by this bull trap, but I'm going to be going over that as well later on too. So definitely hit the like button, subscribe really helps the YouTube channel a lot immensely for the YouTube algorithm. Go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section and let me know what you all want me to go over next. And also, if you want these trading indicators, these automated trading indicators, definitely check out the vital algo link in the description. Use the discount code Marcellus for 25% off. Now, let's go over Baby Doge. So, the first thing I want to mention here with Baby Doge, the 24-hour market control is in control by the bears by 60%, showing 40% bullish. Do not be fooled by this uptrend right here. This is a bull trap, literally. You can see over here with these red areas show less demand for Baby Doge. So the supply and demand areas is showing less demand. So we're definitely going to continue to trend downwards. Like I said in my previous videos, I've been saying like we're going to hit this support line here at 1260. It's only a matter of time. So do not fall for this uptrend that we're seeing here. And I'm only saying this because, you know, a lot of people are like, maybe this is the dip and this is going to be the bottom of it. This is not the bottom of it. If you're trying to buy the bottom of the dip with Baby Doge, it's nearly impossible. You can't time the market. So it's best to get in whenever you can. But right here, what I'm seeing, we're definitely going to hit 1260. So when I buy, I'm probably going to end up getting $1 trillion at 1260. So that's just me personally. That's what I want to do. Bitcoin is projected to hit 30K. So if Bitcoin hits 30K, I mentioned this in my previous videos, we could see Baby Dogecoin hit this next support. Well, not next one down there. That's way, 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 way too low. Not the next support, but like halfway through it. So we may see Baby Doge add another zero and quite possibly get to around here, like the eight area or even maybe the five area. So what I'm saying is adding on another zero and then, you know, doing that stuff that's if bitcoin hits like 30k like if bitcoin is 30k possibly 25k that's what we'll see but if bitcoin doesn't hit that area then baby does will not hit these two areas down here baby does will probably end up stopping way up here so let me uh draw this down here so if bitcoin only goes down to like 35k or like 45k or maybe 40k then we'll probably only see baby doge hitting the 1260 support so that's what I'm looking at here for the technicals. Now, this is not a technical analysis video, even though I'll probably put it in the title. I'm just showing a little bit of the technicals, just letting you all know that this is a bull trap. Do not get fooled. We are not just going to go 100% bullish here. We're definitely going to hit this trend line. Not trend line. We're definitely going to hit the support line of 1260. But I want to go over the actual stuff we got going on in Baby Doge fundamentally. So shout out to everyone that's made it far in this video made it this far shout out to everyone that's going to make it to the end of the video because there's a lot to go over here so as you can see baby doge is doing this bull trap the whole crypto market is doing a bull trap even bitcoin is going on this whole bull trap movement this is a 100 percent trap so do not get fooled by it so anyways let's go over what we got over here we have 1,025,717 holders now inside baby doge hit the refresh button 1,025,754 so we're still getting people every single day inside Baby Doge. But I want to talk about these fundamentals. So let's keep like, pushing here. So first of all, Bybit is definitely looking to add a next meme coin. It already has sheep. It's added sheep. And now Bybit is looking to add something else. So the second most voted coin here was Baby Doge. Baby Doge at 26.6%. And you got Kuma. I don't really don't know what Kuma is. But Kuma is over here at... I think they made no, they didn't mean Kishu. They meant Kuma. I don't know what Kuma is, so let me know in the comment what it is. I mean, Kuma Inu, I didn't even know that existed, but they have a little bit more voters than Baby Doge, and they have a smaller community. So maybe their community is just a little bit more committed than ours. I'm going to go ahead and retweet this. Anyone who hasn't signed this, definitely click this and try to get Baby Doge onto Bybit. Bybit has a good following here 836 thousand people following their twitter which means way more use their exchange so i definitely want to see baby doge like succeeding here you can see dogecoin to the moon trending here on twitter you can see saitama trending on twitter litecoin trending on twitter satoshi but not baby doge so i want to see baby doge trending on twitter as well so hopefully we can start tr trending we're, our, we're always trending on twitter with baby doge so there's definitely no absence of trends there so 
Let's move on to the next thing with Baby Doge. So moving on to the next thing here, the winner. They just now announced the winner for the 1 million holders NFT, exclusive NFT. They gave this NFT out to the winner. So shout out to that person. This person's name is Ricky IP. So this person said, how much will it be worth in the future? I don't know. It's probably going to be worth a good amount of money in the future. But I would definitely hold it. This is a one of a kind. So I would say definitely hold it until it's worth a lot of money. But anyways, moving on to the next thing. Shout out to that winner, by the way. But anyways, over here, you can see this BitMart exchange is actually giving money back to the people directly from their wallet. So over here, it says BitMart is much appreciated in the Baby Dose community. So BitMart completed initial review and identified affected users. So anyone affected by it, they identified them. So the CEO, Sheldon, pretty much tweeted and he said that over here, BitMart will use their own funding to compensate users affected by this so baby doge is in contact with the team of bitmart and will assist any way they can so bitmart is going to be giving their money back to the people who lost it and they're going to also give money back to the baby doge people because you know a lot of people in baby doge lost their money because they haven't had it in bitmart so they're going to be giving money out of their own wallets for that so i'm definitely happy about that shout out to bitmart for making this happen now we have more big news for Baby Doge. So Baby Doge has now been mentioned on Forbes, literally, by TJ Jackson. If you don't know who TJ Jackson is, he is a actor. So he's performing in a bunch of different shows. And, yeah, he's, he's definitely making big moves out there. So shout out to TJ Jackson. And this is really big for Baby Doge as well, for him to get mentioned in Forbes and talk about Baby Doge inside of the Forbes. That's pretty big. So shout out to him for that. He's definitely helping us out a lot here. So TJ Jackson talks about Baby Doge and Forbes. Everyone's talking about this. So we're, gonna, we're about to have a bunch of good stuff coming out here for Baby Doge. But over here, you can see what he said. It says, we all face speed bumps on our road to success. Faith, perseverance, and consistency will determine if you reach your destination. That's definitely very true. I recently began investing in cryptocurrency and was scammed out of $2,000. Wow, that's, that's crazy. So over here, you can see as a rising actor that hurt. But those three keys and my belief in Baby Dogecoin kept me from making a U-turn. So keep driving. You just might be one speed bump away. Your life will change forever like so his. So this is definitely pretty big that he got scammed inside of crypto. And then he just went to Baby Doge, made that money back. Like that's pretty big right there. Shout out to him for making this happen. This is definitely really big over here. But um, you can see some stuff that he's doing over here. You can see TJ Jackson is looking forward to a jam packed 2022. He's going to be inside the second season of the hit series P Valley, a TV show in the fictional Mississippi Delta small town of Chulucia or whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called, but yeah, he's gonna be inside a bunch of different stuff as well. So. Definitely look him up if you want to see him performing and stuff. I think he has some roles playing on a Stars show, on an official Hulu show. So he has a lot going on inside the acting world. And it's definitely really good to see that he's talking about Baby Doge and that he's going to, or that he actually made his money back that he got scammed from inside Baby Doge. So definitely happy to see that this is working out for him. So shout out to the whole team out there for making this happen, the whole Baby Doge army. Like, none of this would be possible without the Baby Doge Army. He's part of the Baby Doge Army. So, shout out to TJ Jackson for that. Now, over here, you can see we have $145,000 burned and 3,180 holders today, new holders. And shout out to Ultra 243 of the Baby Doge Army. Ultra 243 is always posting up good stuff about Baby Doge. So, shout out to Ultra 243 with this info. And then also, shout out to Baby Doge Informer. I got to give the big shout outs to everybody in the Baby Doge Army. So shout out to Baby Doge Informer. Baby Doge Informer just now posted this about Baby Doge. And that was the $145,000 burned in 3.8K or 3.1K holders. So 3,180 holders today new. And then we have 97.27 trillion burned today. That is a total of $145,000. So that's a pretty big burn right there. So yeah, shout out to Baby Doge Army. Shout out to Ultra 243. Shout out to Baby Doge Informer informer shout out to everybody out there putting all of this great news out for baby doge so anyways let's go over some good stuff with baby doge too so i want to talk about the technicals because we still got good things going on in the technicals right so 
every time people buy in Baby Dogecoin, right? Every time people are buying, we're getting these reflections. We're getting the taxes. Every time they sell, we're getting these taxes. So as you see the price going up here rising, yes, it's a bull trap. But as people put more money in, we're still getting those reflections in. So don't think just because we are going in a bull trap that it's not worth holding Baby Doge. Yes, we all know Baby Doge is about to continue to go down. Yes, we know we're about to hit 1260 support. But that's a good thing because as we hit that support, we're getting more and more Baby Doge in our wallet. Because we all know inside the Baby Doge army, we all know we're going to be knocking out at least two zeros by the end of next year. So if you hold this by the end of next year... You're going to be having all these reflections that you're building up on. So, yes, you could sell out now and then buy back in at 1260 Yes, you could do that, but you're going to miss out on all the coins that you would have got. Yeah, you bought the dip, but you also missed out on coins. But, I mean, it kind of it kind of levels itself out because – but then when you think about it, you're also paying that 10% tax. Like if you sell now and buy back in at 1260 you're paying 20% tax pretty much. 10% when you sell, 20% when you buy back in. So you got to think about that. You're not – you're not really making any money when you try to trade Baby Doge. Baby Doge is not the coin to be day traded or swing traded. It's not the thing to be doing that. Do not just try to trade Baby Doge and think that you're going to make money on it. Like, it's not how it works. Unless you're up 100%, you're not making money on Baby Doge. And technically, unless you're up 30%, because 10% to buy in, 10% to sell out. So technically, you need to do like 21% to even make a 1% gain on Baby Doge. And 30%. To make a 10% gain on baby doge. So that is pretty much the numbers that we got going on there. But anyways, this is all I got for you all today. I just wanted to go over this and let you all know exactly what's going on in baby doge and exactly what's going to be happening next. So anyways, hit the like button, subscribe. It really helps the YouTube channel a lot immensely for the YouTube algorithm. Leave a comment in the comment section and let me know what you all want me to go over next. And also, if you want these automated trading indicators, definitely check out the vital algo link in the description and use the discount code Marcellus for 25% off. And as always, I'll be back with another video. Peace.